So you might be wondering what a Google crawl is. Well, I know it's a fancy term, but it just means how often does Google come to my site? And today we're going to talk about how to make sure that when Google does come a knockin, your website is a rockin. A lot of the questions I get from clients and from prospects are, why doesn't Google love me? How come I'm not seeing Google love? So what's important to understand here is that there's no, there's no emotionality here. Google's coming, they're coming to your website about eight seconds. So let me step back. So what happens is when you launch a website, Google will come back usually in 24 to 48 hours. Now that's an approximation because it depends on how often you are creating content to begin with. So the first thing you have to look at is, do I have an old site versus a new site? An old site has a cadence, I like to call it. Now this cadence is how often you blog. Do you blog every week, every month, once a quarter, once a year, or nothing? Remember that if Google's trying to find who the experts are by keyword phrase, then they're looking at how current is your information. So if you have a cadence, my recommendation would be, if you're gonna do a weekly blog, you launch it at 10 o'clock on Tuesdays. So what happens is you're training Google, right? You're going, who's a good boy? Come visit my site. Here's a snacky, right? And every time you launch a blog, you're giving them a really high quality snack. And if you're doing it every Tuesday at 10, then it knows when it's gonna get its snack. And that's how you can build a cadence with Google and how often they crawl your website. Now the next one is I'm getting ready to launch a new site. So this is super important because when you go to launch it, it's very important that you connect the old pages with the new pages. So we're saying, hey Google, don't forget about me. I got all these old pages here, but I'm gonna have to connect them to the new pages. Your web developer will need to do this before the website launches. Now listen to me on this before the website launches, not after. Otherwise, you're gonna lose all those connections and you're gonna start all over from scratch. We don't want that. That's called a redirect document. It's a nerdy concept, but you need to make sure you have that conversation because when the website gets launched and it crawls it again, we wanna see all those old pages match to all these new gorgeous pages. We don't wanna start from scratch. So it's very important when it comes, like I said, when you launch a new website, it will come to the page, usually 24 to 48 hours, grab all the content. Great, yay, you got a new website, good job. Then it comes back in 24 hours and says, what do you got, what do you got? Then it comes back in another 48 hours, what do you got, what do you got? Do you see how if you don't have something new for it to digest, it will start visiting you longer and longer and longer. Okay, so this is the kind of content that I'm created to. So if you've had any frustrations with your website or you have questions about Google crawl, put me too down in the comments, say, or put a question in the comments and I watch these and I will answer them because I wanna make sure that you understand how Google is currently crawling your website. Remember, Google is voracious. It expects a lot of fresh content every day. So you have to think about, if I've got a new website, I better create some kind of ongoing conversation with Google so it keeps coming back, seeing my genius and my brilliance, and then it ranks exactly where I want it to for people to find me and ultimately hire me. So remember, when Google crawls your website, it's our job as business owners to give them great content that's findable and do it in a pattern or cadence that Google can come to rely on and trust. That's what makes a great spiderable or crawlable website again and again and again. I am totally committed to creating great content, but I know there's a lot of different things and maybe you're like thinking, how can I get all this in the right order? Well, this is what we do at our workations. Findability Accelerate Retreats are where you come to Denver. We spend two and a half days getting our nerd on, we pop open our laptops, and we get to work. You're gonna leave after two and a half days with all your keyword research, your competitor intelligence, and how to map out your website for real findability. Check us out at findability.com retreats, and I can't wait to get you to implement all the great things that are in this YouTube channel. So make sure to subscribe, hit the bell so you get my little tidbit videos every single day.